call the uh, October meeting of the City Commission to order. Can everyone please rise and face the flag? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right. Don, could you call the roll? Gary Corbin. Tony Gross. Here. Jeff Lorenz. Here. 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 All right. Uh, do we have a motion to approve the September City Commission meetings? Motion to approve. Minutes. Second. Minutes. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Hearing none. Motion passes. All right. The uh, agenda has been uh, circulated. Has everyone had a chance to look over it? I don't think we have any additions to be made to it. Do we have a motion to approve the October agenda? Motion to approve October agenda. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion passes. All right, announcement from commissioners. Jeff, do you have anything? Go ahead. Hold down the Harpeth was a success. Um, a lot of fun. No injuries, but great. Bob? Mm -hmm. Art in the Park was real good. Lots yeah. of vendors, yeah. I guess my only thing is I guess we should all have our thoughts and prayers with uh, Commissioner Corley, who's not able to attend yes. tonight because of his... Uh, his unfortunate uh, injury, and hopefully he'll be up and back with us in no time at all. Um, all right, community input. Would anyone like to? Doesn't look like we have any community out here to to input. So, all right, department reports. Everyone's had a chance to look through those. Do you guys have anything to add to the department reports, John, Debbie? Yes. All right, legal. Greater Dixon franchise still remains in the lobby of the order. I've left another message for uh, Mr. Smith, the attorney for Dixon Gas. Please send the ordinance to us. We're ready to vote on it. So, so did he not respond? This is Jerry, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So the times that I've actually been on the phone with him, he said, you know, I'll get it to you, and then it hadn't come through. So I will continue to follow up. I, I've got the same situation when I was paying him, too. So okay. Just okay. All right. We have no unfinished business, new business. We have an update on the state required utility district commission, commissioner training. We discussed doing that here, but John's done a little footwork on this, and I thought he could give us a quick rundown. I will. The, the training requirement was enacted in April of this year. Um, <coughs> I've spoken with uh, both MTAS and TAUD, which is the Tennessee Association of Utility Districts, just to clarify the timeline of the training. Since it was enacted in April and all of the commissioners here uh, were already in office when it was enacted, your time frame does not begin until you are re-elected. So uh, the time frame is you've got a year, 12 months to complete your first 12 hours of training and then you have three years after that to complete another 12 hours. Your clock doesn't officially start until you are reelected since you are already in office. So that means that the November elections of next year, 2018, that's when the clock starts for the people that are elected into office then. That's when their 12-month clock starts for the first 12 hours of training. And so would that mean that the three of us theoretically are 2020? Correct. Correct. Okay. So, but we probably should still, if we're going to, I mean, we right. have to do it, we should. We're not on a very tight time frame to get things done. And um, also that said, I spoke with TAUD about doing training here uh, in Kingston Springs or regionally rather than going to Nashville or Cool Springs or someplace else that uh, arranges it. And they do do traveling training. They uh, require about 12 people to make it somewhat beneficial for them. So I've reached out to Ashland City. They'll have new commissioners in December. So uh, we've got us, we've got Pegram, uh, Ashland City. Uh, if we can get 12 people together, we can do the training. Fantastic. Locally, po possibly even here in Kingston Springs. That would be so great if we did be wonderful. Here. Yeah, we'll try to get on that. I I'm with you that even though our clock's not started, it would probably be good just to get it out of the way kind of under everybody's belt. Uh, since it is sort of extensive with 12 hours, so we'll try to do that sometime in the first quarter of next year. All right, and then the only other item we have is the uh, slogan writing contest. I've, I've been keeping up with the ones on Facebook. Yes, um, there are but. official slogans and there are unofficial slogans. The, um, the contest runs through November 3rd. Um, 
right now we have 35 official entries and there are, as we mentioned, several more suggestions on the town's Facebook page. I'll post again next Monday, which is the 23rd, just a reminder that we've got two weeks left, and then I'll post the following week, which I think is the 30th, let everybody know it's the final week to see if we can get some more. Right now, some of the uh, most interesting official submittals are Kingston Springs, the soul of the Harpeth, Kingston Springs, where a river runs through it, small town, big heart, small town, big community, Kingston Springs, come for a visit, stay for a lifetime, uh, Kingston Springs, modestly magnificent. Some of the more interesting non-official entries. Kingston Springs, don't pass us by unless it's Sunday, then everything's closed. Uh, <laughs> Kingston Springs, you can't afford to live here. Um, Kingston Springs, quiet, don't tell anybody. And Kingston Springs, Nashville's cuter cousin. What about it's not Pegram? Uh, that one was on there too. <laughs> <laughs> that one. And, and my favorite, Kingston Springs, we used to have a McDonald's. Yes, that's my, <laughs> that's my favorite. Was, <laughs> there was one I found slightly offensive, but I've already forgotten it. So. That's good. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Moving right along. So once we get the, a full list, then uh, we can call that down to an, a, a manageable list of, of uh, take out any duplicates and some similarities, and then we'll come down to a shorter list where we can discuss and then vote. Thank you. All right. That is everything. We have no items to surplus. We have, is there anything else anyone would like to discuss? I have a couple of others. We're not going to get a record tonight, are we? No. I just want to let you know John passed his last and oh, final great. test. Oh, great. Congratulations. Um, and um, I put a copy in front of you all. We got approved for our note for the sewer logo. Oh, great. Yeah. All right. That was quick. That was quick. All right. Uh, the reminder is we have the Thanksgiving brunch November 8th. That's always a really good time. Uh, we have a motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. Second? Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All right.